Hi, beautiful souls. Today, I'm sharing a little light on knowing, inner knowing, just knowing, knowing that you are enough, knowing that you are confident, knowing and being certain in yourself, knowing. In these beautiful days of change, insistent, constant change, change is inevitable. But in these beautiful days that we live in the here and now, I notice more people stepping into their sovereignty, knowing how powerful and unlimited they are. And as unlimited beings, we are able to create and be anything. In the past, humans have been very much contained only doing a small amount of what was available to them, <laughs> walnut tree. And um, they kept themselves small. And of course, when you keep yourself small, you're so easy to be controlled, easy to be controlled by big companies, by those that hold the majority of the money on the planet. And when you are able to see beyond that, hold your perspective high enough and you're able to see through things to the truth of everything that is you really know you know what's going on you feel it deeply within your heart those that have abandoned themselves they find it difficult to know because they don't trust in themselves and to trust in yourself you just kind of go home to yourself you come back home to yourself you come back to the essence of that that you are and if you want to know the answers for anything you go within and you ask yourself your own innate guidance system and you keep practicing that until you get clearer and clearer and clearer with what it is that your unique expression of light your soul wishes for you to do at any given moment what resonates for you whether that's work-wise places spaces adventures, people, animals. I mean, there's, we're so unlimited and there's so much excitement and joy and magic and miracles and wonderment on this planet to play with and experience. Why be doing something that you're not even sure is what you want to do? And all of these television sets that people so eagerly plug into, not realizing that they're a huge distraction, not knowing it, they were to unplug, they would know. They would know for sure that that's just a distraction. How well do you know yourself? Do you really feel that you know everything that there is to know about you? And when I say that, you're never going to know everything about yourself because why would you want to know that? That would take away a lot of the fun. Sometimes we feel like we know ourselves pretty well. And then out of the blue, we're like, oh my gosh, I've just realized I have a newfound love and an excitement for watching surfing. Um, you know, surprises are a part of the fun aspect of knowing ourselves, knowing that we are amazing, that we are unlimited, and that we're always capable of learning new things, always capable of exploring new places, making new friendships, and there are twists and turns along our paths, and we don't always expect them, and that's what's fun. But knowing that when they show up, we have the confidence, the certainty within ourselves, and that inner knowing that we can handle anything, and that therefore we can go for it with all of our heart, open, ready to embrace the experience. How well do you know yourself? How trusting are you in everything that you are? Knowing. Isn't it a beautiful thing to know and to trust and to be certain in oneself, so sovereign, so free, that you don't ever have to ask anybody for their advice, 
because you know it yourself. Exactly the way, exactly the route on your path. And that's incredibly freeing. I send you love. I send you light. My name is Zaza and I come to you from the hedgerow. Like, subscribe and share, please. Thank you.